Hello, welcome to Linda Likes Tarot. Hi, my name is Linda. If you're new, welcome. If you're returning, what's up? I'm glad that you're back. Okay, so this reading for today is going to be for whoever it's meant to be for. Please be your own leader of discernment while watching this general reading. Okay? Okay. Boshka is acting up. I don't know why. Probably because there's an important message going on. Okay. There's someone here that's um, having to learn to accept things for how they are. Accept, accepting you for who you are. Accepting their consequences is what I'm getting. Okay. This card keeps falling on the floor. And this is the reason why I'm doing this reading. Okay. It's this. Find the exit. You are wrapping up this chapter of your life and it's time to move on gracefully now okay you guys are going to be exiting something leaving something leaving a phase of your life right now and moving into something different maybe there's someone here that doesn't like the changes baba Whoever I'm speaking to, you could be going through a spiritual awakening at this point. You could be waking up a lot at 3 a.m. Okay. Bosh. No, you can't. This cat keeps trying to lay on this table. You cannot, Baba. Not today. Okay. Also, you guys could be um, feeling like there's a lot of people talking about you or discussing you so you could be experiencing your re your ears ringing that's because they're they, they are people are talking about you okay and they can't accept that you are who you are and that they aren't part of this next chapter okay what else baba don't you dare holy spirit holy angels what else do they need to know there's something about a portal as well, because these cards are called the Sacred Soul um, Portal. There's something about a portal here that you're going to be walking into. I feel like I look really greasy. Please forgive me <laughs> for the grease. Bosh. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, what do they need to hear? Yeah, we got high tides here. Okay. It says you may be feeling swamped but the shore is within sight just keep swimming along so regardless how things seem right now just know that you are literally going to be um reaching sh dry dry safe uh shore baba what is wrong this cat's hair holy spirit holy angels tell me more what the heck is going on oh was it yeah you got an open door coming through there's a a door of opportunity here for you one door closes another one opens as if if other options seem closed to you let them go there's another way to open them okay and at the bottom of the deck it says ring of fire oh ring of fire <laughs> it says someone's name could be johnny we have, you are being challenged to stand up for yourself and those you love while the heat is on. So someone here may want to put, put, um, put you in the hot seat or this is like um, the final, um, you know, like at the end of a, the end of anything, like sometimes people get wild, Baba, come on now, like this cat, this cat's getting really like, my cat is desperately trying to get onto my table. Like, Boshka has been trying to do this, like, all day. Even when I was doing personal readings um, today, that's what this cat has been doing. <sighs> Boshka. You guys could be experiencing a lot of distractions at this time or try to ignore distractions at this time because, um... Someone really wants you to um, not be, doesn't want you to concentrate on the things you're supposed to concentrate. I'm also um, getting something about like, uh, 
someone's haunted by the ghost of you, the memory of you, okay? All right. They could feel like they're they're doomed to a to a pit of fire. Okay. No. No, baba. This is the vibe I'm getting. Holy Spirit, holy angels, what else do they need to hear regarding this information that we're getting? Yeah, we got this Pluto out here again. Whoever I'm speaking to, you're definitely in your north your north node or you're on your way. Okay, you're going to be experiencing some sort of success here. Success will be yours, okay? Someone doesn't want you to benefit from stepping into your own to your your destiny. Stop. There's someone here that wants to have control over you and they're upset because they can't. Okay? This is what I'm getting here. Baba. Like how I'm fighting with this cat right now. Like this is my table. Not your not your nap time table. <laughs> Someone wants somebody wants to sit at your table that is being presented for you from the divine. Like someone wants to like say like no, I'm invited. I don't care if you don't think I'm I don't get a seat. I'm going to get there. I belong there. I'm entitled to some shiz like that. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, can you tell me more? What else is going on? What else is going on? Okay, yeah, somebody here took a, a gamble here. I'm also getting like you took a gamble and you had faith in yourself. You chose to believe in yourself and took a leap of faith. And this is why you're going to be experiencing some sort of level of success into your life. Okay. Someone here is overwhelmed, okay, by you doing this because it's leading you to freedom. By the way, y'all is free. Just like that Aquarius sweet I just did. You freed yourself by healing yourself, okay? Especially by healing um toxic relationships, clearing them from from you. Or whatever, healing whatever was um, keeping you in toxic relationships or cycles. Or you, you did this. You did this. Congratulations, okay? Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, thank you. Someone here could be a Virgo. I could be talking to a Virgo. You could have Virgo somewhere in your chart or you're dealing with one, okay? Yep. Yeah, the methods for the healing power. The power of healing. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, tell me more. What zodiac signs are involved in this situation? You guys could be dealing with a Capricorn or you could have Capricorn somewhere in your chart. Tell me more, Spirit. You could be dealing with a Taurus or you could have Taurus somewhere in your chart. You have Libra. You could be dealing with the Libra. You could have Libra somewhere in your chart. We have Leo. You could be dealing with the Leo or you could have Leo somewhere in your chart. And we have Scorpio. You could be a Scorpio or you could have Scorpio somewhere in your chart. Or Aquarius. You could have Aquarius somewhere in your chart or you're dealing with one. Bosk. No. Baba. No! Okay. Oh. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. It's almost like you, you're... Seven of Wands. Always having a, like, defense. I feel like that period or chapter of your life is going to be over. Yeah, we have Forge a Path. Making headway, moving quickly, leadership position. Whoever I'm speaking to, you're moving from another position into this leadership position, okay? You did this by overcoming something. You're going through some sort of breakthrough or you have broken through something here, okay? This could have been like um, 
you could have rediscovered something about yourself okay or you just took back your power you're going to achieve success here for show something about the full moon is of significance because both of these cards have a full moon in them okay holy spirit holy angels what else do they need to know yeah protection you need to know that you are protected here okay and that your goals need need a lot of nurturing at this time or that's where your focus needs to be on is your goals okay and to hold on to your boundaries at this time in order to protect yourself we have rocky shore it says bumpy ride uncertain outcome stay the course so for some of you you may you could have had a lot of options um that uh were once available to you and now they are closed or someone has been trying to block opportunities for you um you need to know that they are going to be opening up um and to stay the course because maybe wherever direction you thought you were supposed to go to the divine is redirecting you to somewhere else okay so just keep the faith alive is what i'm getting i'm also getting like you're being asked to take a risk in a different direction for some of you not all y'all okay we have blue moon there's some sort of rare opportunity that's going to be coming in or whatever wish that you've made is coming in you definitely have good luck on your side for show the ring of fire turn burn 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 okay the word burn is coming up a lot in today let me see what the look someone here could be older let me let me see what the heck this is i could be talking to someone who's older because i've been channeling a lot of older songs This is about love, possibly. It says love is a burning thing. And it makes a fiery ring. Bound by wild desire. I fell into a burning ring of fire. I went down, down, down. I fell into a burning ring of fire. Let me see. I went down, 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 and the flames went higher, and it burns, 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 the ring of fire, the ring of fire. Oh my gosh. You guys might fall out in love with somebody soon. You and someone else, when your guys' hearts meet, the passion is going to be burning so wildly and so intensely that you're not going to even know what to do with yourself. You could be with someone who plays the guitar or you play the guitar or someone here plays the ukulele or someone sings. Okay? interesting oh holy spirit holy angels what the heck is going on what do we need to know it says you pull the strings that control your own life so just know that like no matter what someone here is trying to do in order to control the outcome of your life with this pluto obsessive power struggle vibe know that you're the ultimate creator of your life Okay. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. No other human being can control or dominate what you got going on. Okay. It says sometimes the best things are created from chaos with this high tides. 
okay so whoever i'm speaking to you you're like a diamond okay you could have been put through a lot of um you could have been under a lot of pressure or something or you could have gone through or had to overcome a lot of burdens or figure things out by yourself through like chaos I also feel like you going through chaos helps you learn how to protect yourself in some way, okay? It also helps you have a, a clearer vision of what direction you wanted to go in life, okay? I'm also getting whoever I'm speaking to, the chaos is what made you who you are. Like, it could have made you more resilient, it strengthened you. It strengthened you. Okay. I also, I'm getting like for some of you, whenever you're faced with chaos, it makes you calmer or something or, well, I wouldn't want to say calmer, but like when you're faced with chaos, like you're, you're immune to it. I think that's a better word. You're, you're immune to it. Okay. But it, it's only because you have you have experience with this. Yeah, it's because you were rare. You were a rare flower that blooms in the dark. Keep going. See, what I'm getting is like your enemies, your ops fucked up. Okay? They, this is the vibe of like someone was kicking you while you were down while you were in the dark even like when you didn't know who you were or you didn't know your full potential or your power or your hidden talents or your spiritual rank okay or that when you were in the dark like when you were still in the matrix okay somebody turned you into a gosh dang beast because you were able to get out the darkness being blindfolded and by having faith. Faith got you out the dark. You could, you now can be a light bearer for others or something like that. Or this is giving me Har Harriet Tubman vibes. Like you can lead people out the darkness now into freedom. I also feel like whatever... Whatever helped you out this chaos and out this darkness was love. Okay? Tell me more. We have, when you rise to the challenge, it rises to meet you. So, like, there's no challenge that you can't overcome. You are the storm. Okay? You are the fucking storm. We have perspective is a matter of where you stand. <laughs> so whoever I'm speaking to, your perspective of life has completely changed or it will. Okay. Because of what you have gone through, because of the type of um, chaos that you have gone through. Even when it comes to your love life, your family dynamic, your workplace dynamic. <laughs> it all caused you to grow spiritually, emotionally, mentally, okay? It's like almost like you're ready now to get to this next level because of the lessons you learned during these stages. Somebody angry, I feel like, because Boshka's walking around like grumpy. So I feel like someone's like, meh. <laughs> Because you overcame something, okay? <laughs> Listen, I used to work for a small a small company. Well, it wasn't really that small. Well, kind of. Um, and they didn't have, like, an HR department. And I remember, like, everybody at work would always come up to me and be like, basically, come to me with their problems to vent. And I was basically the person, like, I was all, I was like their therapist, like, to help people through stuff. Um, 
because our boss was like a uh, very dominant very well eccentric i guess um but kind of like i don't want to say abusive but chaotic the the workplace was very chaotic and toxic and um everyone would always ask me like oh linda how can you like why do you always how are you able to handle it because like everybody else would like be complaining or being like oh my god da, da, da. and i'd just be like it's not that i was chilling it was just like growing up like with a narcissistic parent and always having to walk on eggshells and like never knowing like what to expect from my from that parent that toxic parent like it prepares you for like it I don't know how to explain it like it prepares you for dealing with people like that in the real world I don't know how to exp <laughs> I don't know how to explain it but it was just kind of like I don't know anyway maybe some of you this is resonating Like, whenever something like that goes down, when chaos goes down, I'm always, like, the the one. I Like, I don't know. It's like I, I switch into, like, a clearer mindset. Can you stop, gosh? This cat is losing his shit. Someone's losing their shit right now. Because you're, because of you exiting a cycle. Because something is being wrapped up. They're losing it. You're, you're forging a new path for yourself. Someone feels like they're losing control over you, okay? Yeah, you're going into this new joyful chapter. Whoa. You're going to this joyful chapter here. Okay. It says, take pride in your accomplishments. Celebrate and enjoy your life. Fate is on your side. Or Yeah, it says, happiness, fulfillment, and joy. Yeah, you need to know that you are protected or you need to continue to protect your energy. Okay. Somebody wants to find you in a vulnerable spot. Okay. Maybe, um, yeah, just keep, keep your boundaries up. One more. Yeah. You're being asked to keep going even if you, you don't know which next steps you have to take. It says step by step, keep going, and it will lead you to destinations you might not have considered. Okay, it says unknown hidden blessings. You guys are about to experience some sort of hidden blessings here, okay? Someone here could have been talking a lot of ish about you, all right? It says people are gossiping behind your back. It would be wise to be careful with your actions right now. It says bad reputation, enemy, bad talk. So you have someone here who's just doing a lot of this and doing a lot of that. Doing a whole lot of nothing. Holy Spirit, holy angels, can you tell me what the heck is going on? Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, they're just going down, down, down to, to a burning ring of fire with their mouth moving. Tell me more, Spirit. <laughs> Tell me more. Who is this person talking ish about my peeps? An Aries. It could be an Aries that's talking mad shit about y'all. Or someone who has Aries somewhere in their chart, or you do. Tell me who the hell out here, or this is a boss for some of you, because Aries is like, a, could be a boss, or this could be someone who is your, a father figure, your father, a father-in-law, um, a baby father, place it where it needs to go, tell me more spirit, who's, who's talking ish, this person could have the Chinese zodiac sign of a tiger, note the date, this also could be a false flame of yours, or someone who's connected to your false flame, who's talking ish, who's this enemy, who is this enemy, this enemy could be a Pisces, or they could have Pisces somewhere in their chart, or you do. Place it where it needs to go. Someone's wishing or speaking death over your life is what I feel like. This could have been someone that you once considered a soulmate, okay? Um, or this is a sibling of yours or a family member. We have friend, acquaintance, or coworker could be talking mad-ish, or someone's talking mad-ish to your friends, your acquaintances, or your coworkers, or even to a new connection that you're with in order to... Um, have them close the door on you okay someone here could have the chinese zodiac sign of a rabbit note the date this could be you or them 
okay talking ish tell me more mm. there's someone here that feels deeply for you it says embrace your feelings and allow to feel them fully love is entering your life open heart emotions and love so gosh dang I feel like there's someone here who's accepting the fact that they truly do have love for you. Okay, someone here could be feeling your loss. Or someone here had a heal from heartbreak here. There's someone here who's now seeing both sides of a situation when it comes to your guys' relationship. And they want to come in and express some sort of emotions here, okay? There's someone here that now sees truly like who you are or someone sees your heart truly or that you're doing something truly from the heart. There's a lot of people that are envious of this situation. Okay. Or they will be. Yeah, listen. Someone here was really trying to control your life. Whoever was doing this is someone who's um, doing something that was unfair. Okay says there is an unequal power dynamic in a situation that needs to be brought back to balance it says unequal unfairness conflict okay i'm also getting you need to know that you are being protected from unfairness especially if someone here is trying to throw you off balance um you're protected i'm also getting like this is like the yin and yang right so with twin flames like this is how you guys are represented right the yin and the yang you guys balance each other out um somebody was trying to separate the yin and the yang from being together but you need to know that the, the divine is protecting that okay person Ooh. oh oh <laughs> okay there could be a cancer here that's feeling deeply about you okay or a libra or you're a cancer or a libra and someone's feeling deeply about you okay there could be an aquarius here that's feeling deeply about you or there's someone here feeling deeply about you aquarius okay there's someone here that was definitely trying or that you and another person are mirroring each other at this time Okay. You guys both could be um, protecting yourselves at this time. Both of you could have been created from chaos. <laughs> okay, you guys could have went through some things. All right. And you both are being protected. Someone came in with some sort of um, misleading advice to somebody when it came to you someone's seeing the truth about this now things are being illuminated to this person now this person now sees the light okay let's see let's see let's see let's see holy spirit holy angels let me get out <laughs> Where is it? Okay. Lordy, Lordy. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, what else do they need to hear?
We have damage. It says we both, we both hurting from this. So someone, you guys could both be hurting from the separation from this. You guys could be separated at this time. We have space. I need more time to think. Okay. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. So you guys are both missing y'all. Missing each other. Tell me more. I'm also getting like somebody here could have been saying that like you were only trying to be with them to benefit off of them or vice versa. But the, that's not the truth. Okay. Something like that. Tell me more. Confirmation. What else do they need here? Yeah, there was a lot of confusion here. Someone purposely put someone in this state of confusion. It says, I feel unclear about where we stand. Why does this guy kind of look like Justin Bieber? I don't know why. Someone's name could be Justin. Is it too late for me to say sorry? Because I'm something, something, something. Whoa. <laughs> something like that is going on. Tell me more. Yeah, this person now wants to chase after you. Okay. And I feel like you no longer want to chase after them. You could be running from this person now. <laughs> That's for some of you. No, y'all. We have holding back. It says, I should have expressed myself better. So somebody, you and another person... They're, the communication was bad, okay? Or somebody here struggles with expressing themselves or communicating. And this is what's kind of fucking up the situation. Yeah. It says, I want to have an equal give and take. So somebody wants to really balance something out between y'all. This person feels like they failed, Okay. Says I failed to give you what you need, neglected. Okay, so maybe this is something that happened in this connection. Um, maybe you already know this person. I feel like I feel like a lot of you you do. Some of you don't even want this person back, but for some of y'all you do. I don't know. We have secrets. It says I haven't told you everything, so someone wants to come in and tell you the full truth and nothing but the truth. Or there's someone here that they're connected to that's gonna tell them the truth that they lied to them about something which caused some sort of confusion or caused them to look at you in a different light we have absence it says i feel like a part of me is missing without you so this person is definitely missing you you have a cold someone's name could be cole or nicole we have the lesson i learned from us will never be forgotten yeah ciao someone's not happy with how things have gone yeah someone was afraid of what other people would think that's why they didn't want they were hesitant to give to you or show you the same love you were giving them there was a lot of gossip going on okay i'm also getting there's a lot of gossip about about somebody coming in to to give to give you an uh, an equal give and take we have chemistry there's a lot of fucking chemistry here it says i have never felt a passion this intense damn story we have sabotage at the bottom of the deck it says i mess up the good things in my life sometimes so this person feels like you're the one that got away they feel like they messed up big time when it came to you someone feels like they took a gamble and loved and they fucked it all up Someone feels like they dropped the ball when it came to you. Um, I'm also getting like with this fifth house out here. It's like giving me like this is the this this situation. Uh, or the love and the chemistry you have with this person is so powerful that no matter what the fuck happened, love will always win or something like that love always prevails something like that so i guess this is a love reading holy spirit holy angels can you tell me more what the heck is going on
What is this hidden blessing? You're Jesus. A hidden blessing is some sort of wealth, okay? Or some sort of abundance. Or someone coming in having deep, rich feelings for you. I'm also getting your health and your wealth is protected as well, okay? There's a masculine energy that wants to travel towards someone or something. I'm also getting like someone travels for work. This man. Someone could be, um, I don't know what it's called. The, they work at the port or something. Okay. Yeah, you're being protected from some sort of drama or some sort of, um, Someone coming in to try to start a fight with you. Okay. Someone was ho really hoping that you would make the wrong choice or someone here would make the wrong choice when it comes to love and you. Ay, ay, ay. People. What is wrong with people? Tell me more. What else do we need to know? we got the moon someone really wants to share how they feel with you this could be a cancer don't have to be though or someone here who has cancer somewhere in their chart someone's following their uh, instincts to do this okay yeah someone could have been repressing how they felt about you for a very long time Someone here has been desiring you. Someone feels like they belong to you or you belong to them. Or you make this person feel like um, they're heard. Yeah, you make this person feel like they're heard or that they're seen. You make this person feel understood. Okay, you make them feel safe. You, they see you as their home, okay? Damn, tell me. Yeah, whoever I'm speaking to, you're in your north node. I'm also getting like, um, this person's part of your destiny. Or everything that has happened, it was, it was supposed to happen, okay? It was destined to happen. In order for you to learn the lessons you need to learn. In order for you to overcome these challenges. Okay? Because there were certain skills that you needed to learn. And certain tools that you needed to use. These skills and tools will help you remain balanced in the future. Something like that. Tell me more. Oh, Lord. There's a lot. Okay. You and this person are supposed to create something. Someone's deciding to surrender. Okay. And go after their desires. Yeah, this is a faded connection. There's going to be some sort of turning point here. Damn. Whoever I'm speaking to, you're about to reach some sort of level of fulfillment. Damn. Yeah, someone here is about to get some sort of public recognition here. Because they decided to step into their own power. Take charge of their own life. Go after what they love.
this is beautiful someone here could be a capricorn or they could have capricorn somewhere somewhere in their chart yeah something here about your willpower i'm also getting like um yeah someone's definitely taking action towards you for sure they're they're no longer wanting to hold back or they want to express you guys could be dealing with a sag don't have to be but someone here is setting themselves free is what I, I feel like someone's setting themselves free here you could be a sag place where it needs to go this person wants that we have i do here okay someone here might want to ask you out or something i'm also getting like whoever i'm speaking to whatever you're about to have like a destined job your job is destined whatever this job or opportunity is whatever this door that's opening for you um is destined for you to have okay we have i have A Virgo and a Taurus is out here. Yeah, also... Damn. Whoever's in their north node, you're you're there, you're going to see like um, an uptick in your resources as well. In your material possessions. Damn. Gosh. Dang. Yeah, you're about to receive some new information about something here or someone here is going to finally communicate with you or reach out to you. These cards are so gorgeous. <laughs> Dustin, these cards are beautiful. Um, let me see. What else do they need to hear spirit regarding this situation? What can we expect in the future? Yeah, whoever I'm speaking to, like, you have more influence over others than you realize, okay? You could be someone here who, who um, gives people hope, or this is what you're destined to do. I'm also getting there's someone here that's decided that is gaining more insight, okay, when it comes to some sort of confusion, confusing situation, okay. Um, or whoever I'm speaking to, like I said, like that Harriet Tubman vibe, like you are someone who brings light to people, you, you clarify pe things for people while they're in the dark or in the state of confusion. You ease their mind, you give them clarity. Something like that is going on. This is what you're this is what you're supposed to do. For some of you, not all y'all, okay? Um Yeah. And someone here is experiencing some sort of ne negative karma and they know why. got sag out here again whoever i'm speaking to you're someone here who thinks 10 steps ahead you're very intelligent okay you're someone here who reads between the lines you're someone who's very honest and independent outgoing friendly wild and fun okay someone here could be 47 or 43 or there's a Sagittarius around you or someone who has Sag in their chart that's not willing to change, okay? I'm also getting like, you could be a free spirit and someone here keeps trying to deceive you. But it's not working because you could read between the lines is also what I'm getting, okay? Yeah, you guys could be dealing with a, with a karmic Pisces. We have negative attitude and moody tendencies, doesn't get over things easily, escapist, lazy, unmotivated, pessimistic, vulnerable. So this is somebody here oh, who's been trying to get in the middle of something here when it comes to this situation, okay? Yeah, this is someone who still has karmic debt to pay for. This is someone who has unhealthy habits. Okay, they run away from their feelings. 
or they hold on to grudges. What's this? Yeah, something about playing cards. I brought I I picked this up in the Aquarius read. Joker poker. Someone here could be a gambler or someone gambled something when it comes to love. Someone here wasn't showing you all of their cards. Someone here was being very strategic. Okay. Or you need to check something before taking action, okay? Something about good having good communication is of significance here. Because you could be dealing with somebody here who's feeling trapped, they're unable to change, and they want to create some sort of disharmony in your life. Or they will because they're going through negative karma right now. There could have been a Sag out here that was gathering a bunch of people to have the same... Um, negative mindset about you we have mob mentality here someone here was trying their best to to push your buttons here with this pluto out here again in order to have some sort of control over you this is someone here that was very obsessed with you this is someone that doesn't like that you out here free wild and having fun <laughs> um this person was the one that was out here trying to create a lot of chaos in your world Trying to make you feel like your path was unclear. Trying to make you overwhelmed here. This person's obsessed. Tell me more. Bandages in my heart. I want out for you. Bandages, bandages, bandages. Da 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 da. Bandages, bandages, bandages. Yeah, there's someone here that is feeling stuck. They have a lot of resentment towards you. There's a lot of inner demons this person need to work through. Okay, someone here is, their spirit is not clean. Their heart is not clean. Okay, someone needs to work on themselves. End of story. Okay. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, you're being asked to be fearless here, okay? And to enjoy your life. You're also being asked to relax more. I'm also getting like, if this is something that you can't do right now, this is something that you'll be able to have the luxury of doing. Okay? There's something here that you're doing that's in a not, it's considered a non-traditional way of doing something. So this could even be like you having a relationship that's non-traditional, or having a job that's non-traditional or learning something that's non-traditional something like this okay there's someone here that definitely wants to work together with you someone wants to protect you i don't know who's this person that's unclean who's got this unclean heart who's stuck who the hell is this this is someone who's in your family or someone that you had a past connection with. Whoa, whoa. Someone does not like your confidence or your prosperity. All these cards just fell over. Okay. Okay. There could be a family member here that wants to heal something with you, but I don't feel like they have the best intentions. This is someone here that still has a negative attitude. This is still someone who, if you're around them, they're going to try to... Um, they're gonna monkey they're gonna monkey they're gonna muck up your energy okay someone here could have the chinese zodiac sign of a monkey mm. can you tell me who this person is that feel trapped okay there was someone here libra so there could be a libra here that feels trapped or is unable to change this person wants to come in this person has is someone is experiencing karma basically this could be a libra or this could just be karmic justice playing out okay but your twin flame death definitely see something here you have opened your twin flames eyes to something okay I could be talking to a feminine energy or your twin flame is a feminine energy. 
I don't know. I don't know. Let's find out some more information, please. What else do we need to know for that? Actually, I don't want to use these. What else do we need to know? What else do we need to know, Spirit, regarding this reading? What else do we need to know? You're also being asked to go with the flow. We have savage, okay? It says, ruthless, getting what you want. Don't give a fuck. Don't hold back. Tough skin, confident, and badass. Okay, so you could be in this savage-ass energy or someone's viewing you as someone who's savage. Someone here is not giving no Fs, okay? Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, or there's someone here that don't give an F. This could be your cyber bully that was going savage mode on you. This is giving me like they had nothing to lose. <laughs> Or this is someone that doesn't think very highly of themselves. Um, place it where it needs to go. Okay. Or someone wanted to um, lower your confidence by trying to cyber bully you. Or to bully you in general. Okay. This is someone... <laughs> this person didn't realize how unbothered you could be. Okay. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, can you tell me more? Okay, somebody here could smoke because those were two cards of someone smoking with this Savage card and the other card. Um, there's someone here that's pretending that they're someone who's, uh, who's of a high status. This could even be like high a high status spiritually, and this person is not. This could be both. Like, someone could be walking around wearing, like, high fashion um, name brand clothing. Like, Louis Vuitton, Gucci. Um, I don't know what the other ones are. YSL. Whatever. Um, but, like, they can't afford they can't afford this stuff. I don't know. Like, someone feels like they deserve the finer things in life without working for the finer things in life. Or this person feels like they deserve some sort of, like, um, spiritual, like, someone here feels like they deserve some sort of divine gifts, okay? Or someone, there's someone here who's not in their north node that feels like they deserve some sort of blessing for, for those who decide to go into their north node, something like that. Like, someone wants to benefit from what you're going to be benefiting from, or someone feels like what you have, they deserve some weird shit. Tell me more. That's where they went wrong. Okay. This person is salty as hell. It says sudden mood, sudden change of mood, feeling someone did you wrong. Someone here could be very upset, bitter, annoyed, or jealous of you and of your confidence. This is someone here that does know that you're a badass. And that's for some of you. <laughs> this person is tripping. Okay. Tell me more. This person could be obsessively thinking about you, obsessively thinking about how to bring you down. This person was really hoping to try to bring you some sort of fucking nightmares. This person really wanted you to be in a state of fear and anxiety. This person wanted you to be out here hallucinating on some things. This person wanted you to lack sleep, to fuck up your beauty or your handsomeness or just your brain, your clarity. This person was doing the most. I also feel like whoever was cyberbullying you, they're going to be experiencing um, insomnia, paranoia, anxiety. They're going to have a hard time sleeping. Maybe this is the person that's waking up at 3 in the morning all the time. Okay. This person's dumb. We have low IQ. This person didn't think something through. This person underestimated you. Tell me more. Yeah, this person's shook. Because they underestimated you. I'm also getting like... The divine is definitely promoting you at this time. It says, can't believe what they heard. Caught off guard. Unsettled. Shocked. Surprised. Speechless. So someone here is speechless or is going to be speechless because of what, so whatever this blessing in, that's coming in for you that is protected. There's someone here who's overthinking. They're stressed out. And they're overanalyzing a situation. This person could be overly smoking is what it feel like. This person is definitely in their feelings. They're caught up in their feels. They're allowing emotions to control them and overtake them. 
Yeah, this person has no chill. They lost their ability to act rational. Someone's losing their shit. Someone's doing way too much. I also feel like this is someone that you pulled your energy away from. This person's dumb. I'm also getting if someone ghosted you, they feel dumb now. Because they thought you were supposed to run or chase them, but you didn't. Keep getting this. Yeah, you were just like, um, bitch, I ain't dumb. I'm unbothered. <laughs> Bitch, I'm not dumb. I'm unbothered. I'm focused on that. I'm I'm focused on the bag, bitch. Something like that. Something like that could have happened. Somebody thought they had you wrapped around their finger or something. Sad. Let's get our big birth and see what the what we get. Ew. Okay, let me see. Um, actually, let's see what these say. Then we'll get into Big Bertha. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, what do we need to hear at this time regarding what we've already picked up in this reading? What else do we need to know for our highest good? What else do we need to know, Spirit? Please and thank you. Okay. Whatever setup someone was trying to put you in, is failing it did not work don't trust them they have something up their sleeve okay tell me more i feel like you already peeped game we have 12 12 it says you're about to be showered with prosperity baby you're about to live the finer things in life someone pissed they feel like they deserve this holy spirit holy angels you guys can be saying 12 12 a lot we have fake numbers someone here could be um trying to get a hold of you through a an unknown number or a fake account. Tell me more, spirit. What else do we need to know about this situation? Yeah, you're being asked to cleanse. This says, go take a spiritual bath or a shower to wash off their energy. Water is cleansing. Okay. Ooh, tell me more, spirit. We have next victim. It says they will move on to the next person to bad mouth and to become obsessed with. So this is a friend. This is an acquaintance or a coworker that's always picking on someone to bully, bad mouth, slander. You're not the only one. This person has internal issues that they need to figure out. That's the that's the that's what the the gag is. This person, <laughs> this person needs to fix themselves. This person needs to heal. The power of healing. This person need to heal. Okay. It's so sad. Yet. But this is good though. Because without this person being weird. Or trying to. You know. Bully you basically. You wouldn't be getting this goddamn prosperity. For some of y'all. Because karma's coming in. So I feel like for some of you. The, the blessings that they could have gotten. Has just been transferred into your bank account or something like that someone didn't someone someone didn't learn the lesson there was a certain lesson someone was supposed to learn and they didn't learn it is what i feel like is going on <clears throat> that's sad tell me more yeah we got 777 it says luck is on your side well gosh dang yeah because someone here decided to um curse or hex your ass we have dark magic shit It's because somebody thought they were you. They wanted to be you. We have doppelganger, wannabe doppelganger. It says they dress or act like you because they want to be you. Ciao. I think was, um, what the fuck is this? What is this doppelganger? This doppelganger could have the Chinese zodiac sign of a rabbit. Note the date. Okay. Tell me more, spirit. This person could be a Pisces. Okay, this person could be a Taurus. Tell me more, spirit. This person could have the Chinese zodiac sign of a goat. Okay, or these are your signs, place of where you need to go. Or this is an Aquarius. Place it where it needs to go. Tell me more. Why do we got to set up? Who the fuck was trying to set them up? 
a Scorpio. So there was a Scorpio friend, acquaintance, or coworker that was trying to set someone up. Or you're a Scorpio and your friend, your acquaintance, or your coworker was trying to set you up. Place where I need to go, baby. You need to cleanse yourself. Okay. And if you if you already do, you need to do it more. Um at least right now. Okay. this person that did some, uh, some dark magic shit who's the person that did dark magic shit on people libra so there's a libra that was cursing or hexing people out here okay this person could have the chinese zodiac sign of a tiger or you do place it where we need to go baby boo or this was happening to a libra someone here could have the chinese zodiac sign of a dog that this was happening to or that was doing it or there was a Taurus here that was dabbling in some dark magic shit hexing and cursing people okay or this has happened to a Taurus place where we need to go or someone here has the Chinese zodiac sign of a pig note to date ciao Who, who's calling people from an unknown number Ew. <laughs> so there's a cancer here that's uh could be trying to get a hold of you through a fake ass number or a fake profile or something. Tell me more. Ew. This person may think that you guys are soulmates. You could have known this person for a long time, or this is a sibling, okay, or a friend or a coworker. This person could have the Chinese zodiac sign of a pig. Note the date. <sighs> this person wants to get close to you. All right, let's get out, Big Bertha. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, what else do we need to know? What else does the collective need to know when it comes to this situation and what we've already picked up? Uh, some of you need to cut some cords at this time the hell is going on we have regina specter blue lips someone here is definitely going through a spiritual awakening at this time tell me more something about a hateful baby daddy is of concern okay tell me more we have child abuse so something here about this is of significance okay we have um someone's first middle or last name could start with a q Someone here could be very fickle. Someone here could be a very fickle person. Your ancestors are protecting you at this time. Okay. Um, because there's definitely a, a karmic cycle that is ending here. Yeah. Someone here definitely was invading your privacy here. Okay. You could have been someone who gone through child abuse. Okay. When you were younger. And in your adult life, your privacy as an adult is also being invaded. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, can you tell me more? We have um, sacrificing cats, cats screaming. So someone here could be killing animals in order to do something harmful to you, to hex you or curse you. Something about this is of significance. I'm not going to say it. Um, someone here could do or someone does um, something on or for the dark web gross tell me more something about a loan fraud is of significance here ay, ay, ay. we have reminder you were never alone okay ancestors angels spirit guides and god are always around okay watching and protecting you someone's first middle or last name starts with a w that was out here sacrificing cats or that's your initial place where it needs to go someone really needs to cleanse their aura someone really needs to cleanse 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 holy spirit holy angels tell me more you guys can be seeing a lot of dragonflies right now your ancestors and angels are definitely around okay we have hometown friends are reaching out don't answer so you could have like old friends that you don't speak to that are trying to reach out and talk to you okay we have crime was personal so someone here definitely invaded your privacy because on they just was some sort of grudge that were holding against you or something. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, can you tell me more? They were salty about something here. Tell me more, Spirit. 
Yeah, we have you can't fix stupid. So someone here is dumb. They keep saying this. Someone's dumb. Someone here could have tried to scam you. Or someone here is going around saying, like, you're a scam. Okay. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. Or someone here is trying to, like, use fake profiles to be like you in order to scam people. We have Scorpio. This could be a Scorpio or someone here who has Scorpio somewhere in their chart. Or your Scorpio that this is happening to. Also, there's something here that's ending. Okay. Someone here might self-delete. Or someone was trying to make you self-delete yourself. Okay, we have I hate you because you're prettier than me. So someone doesn't like the way you look. Someone doesn't like that you're pretty or you're handsome or whatever. Someone doesn't like that you have a better social status or uh, I don't know, reputation. Whatever the heck it is, someone doesn't like it. They wanted you to take yourself out. Um, or someone was trying to blame someone's self-deletion on you. We have identity fraud. Someone here was trying to be you or someone actually stole your identity to take out some sort of loan or to commit some sort of fraud holy spirit holy angels we have watch your food and drinks around them so you need to watch your food and drinks around somebody here we have crows you guys could be seeing a lot of crows here or someone here was definitely sending a lot of monitoring or hovering spirits around you um something about cnn news is of significance someone here could be a reporter okay or something here about politics is of significance or someone goes back and forth on the, on their beliefs, okay? Someone here could be like, yeah, someone goes back and forth on their beliefs. The math ain't mathin'. We have Pisces, Aries, Cusp. Someone here could be a Pisces, Aries, Cusp. One second, someone could be glorifying like dark magic, and the next second, they have God in their mouth. Something like that is going on. Like, oh, I don't know, something like that. It says, you are exactly where you're meant to be. Okay, it says lower vibrational person. So you're definitely dealing with a lower vibrational person who's monitoring you or spying on you. Um, and they dumb as fuck. We have angry person. This person is very angry or this person wants you to be angry. There's a Scorpio out here that could be very angry at you. Don't have to be. Or could have gotten a whole group of people angry at you. Okay, we have broke into your home. Someone here could have broken into your home. Or try to break into your vessel, into your brain, to your body, trying to get into your head. We have old soul. Whoever I'm speaking to, you're very much an old soul. You've been here before. You're someone here who's very wise. We have healthy lifestyle. You could be someone here who's living a healthy lifestyle. Or there's someone here that thinks that what they're doing is healthy and it's not. We have 12 a.m. So something here about midnight is of significance for some of you. Something here could have been happening at midnight or something has been happening at midnight. Some of you could be waking up at midnight. I'm also getting like every day is a new day. We have drugs, alcohol abuse. So someone here could be using a lot of drugs or alcohol right now. Or this is something that you need to end. Okay. Or stop doing. We have November. Something about the month of November is very significant. Okay. Maybe someone tried to do something to you last November. And it's going to be revealed uh, this no this November about um, a forged signature here. Somebody could have signed your name on something. You need to know that justice is definitely on your side when it comes to this situation, okay? Someone here was trying to poison someone and get away with forging a signature on a piece of paper. 777, this is all about some sort of spiritual growth. I'm also getting, you're going to get some, someone going to get a lucky break here. We have... Refusing to see positives in one own in one's own life. Okay, so someone here loves being the victim Someone loves being the victim. Nothing's ever their fault. Okay, we have Libra Virgo cusp You could you could be a Libra Virgo cusp or this person is place where it needs to go um, And then we have Aquarius Someone here could be an Aquarius We have industry baby, little Nas X. It says they never rooted for you anyway, and now they want to come back and act like they're, you guys are cool. This person wants you to fall back into doing drugs or alcohol is what I feel like for some of you. Or this person is going to put something in drugs or alcohol. This person says that they need your voice. They need to speak to you. Why is my chest feeling so flipping heavy right now? There could be something going on with someone's lungs. I did say something about smokers. Someone here could be a heavy smoker or somebody's realizing like their health is declining because they're a smoker.
This could be a Gemini. Someone here could be a Gemini. Yeah, you need to know justice is on your side. For real. There's some sort of case that might have some sort of natural... Natural? Why do I always say that? National exposure here. Yeah, something again about 3 a.m. Yeah, someone here is pretending to be spiritual to be with you. So be careful. This could be friends, family, business, whatever. Someone wants to come and pretend like they're spiritual with you. They see the angel numbers like you do and all that other shit. But this person is just studying you, analyzing you in order to come in to try to speak your language or try to find a way to get close to you. But this person is still on some weird shit. Okay. This person could be someone who's a felon. I'm also getting someone here is going to be getting charged with a felony. Or someone here was trying to set you up so that you could be charged with a felony because this person is very much envious of you. Someone here could have could have signed your name on a document and did something illegal with it or something. Yeah, we got 808. You guys could be seeing this number a lot. Be careful with your finances at this time. We have abandonment issues. Yeah, someone here feels abandoned by you. Or the reason why someone abuses uh, drugs and alcohol is because they have unhealed abandonment issues that they need to fucking address. This could be a Capricorn Aquarius cusp or a Capricorn or an Aquarius. Tell me more, spirit. Someone's first, middle, or last name could start with an A. We have God grant me the serenity to accept the things I cannot change, the courage to change the things that I can, and the wisdom to know the difference. Um, someone needs to go to AA or rehab. We have impersonating an officer. So someone here could be doing this or someone here is trying to be somebody that they're not. Like I was saying before, we have FBI. Someone here is, someone knows what this person was doing. Okay. Also, God knows what this person was doing. We have karma is a bitch. Someone's going to be experiencing karma. Yeah, this thief... This thief is going to be experiencing karma. Somebody stole something from you. They could have stole happiness and joy from you, opportunities and love for you, opportunities and jobs for you, and friendships. Whatever this fucking person did, they get in fucking karma. Okay? This person continued to kick you while you were down. Someone here, this is coming to an end. Or there's a mature woman that might be passing away. So some of you, not all y'all. Yeah, something here is definitely changing or some of you will be moving soon. There's an ambulance going. Someone here might go to the hospital. Yeah. And someone here is going to be left in poverty or left out in the cold. This is something that's destined to happen or you were destined to leave someone behind here. You got nothing but great fortune coming towards you, okay? Generational wealth. You're someone here who has cleansed your, your bloodline, okay? Or this is what you're leaving behind. I'm getting something like it's starting with you. It's starting with you. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, can you tell me more? What else do they need to hear regarding this situation? Yeah, you have reason to celebrate. You worked hard. You need to know that you possess everything necessary to become great. You don't need anything outside of you. You don't need anyone to partner with you in order to be great. You can do all bad by yourself. Whoever I'm speaking to says no river can return to its source, yet all rivers must have a beginning. Tell me more spirit. It says certain things catch your eye, but pursue only those that capture your heart. So please only go after the things that, um, that your heart desires. Okay. 
yeah we have climb up the ladder it says you're climbing the ladder of success one step at a time whoever i'm speaking to you're about to see more success in your life or you're about to receive some sort of promotion here or there's going to be some sort of improvement here in your finances your emotional well-being um your peace your environment something like that some of you are going to be um you guys are being chosen for a raise okay spiritually or physically tell me more what else do they need to hear yeah there's going to be love here there's love coming in Some of you might resist this new love <laughs> you're being asked not to. It says true love will find you and it will awaken your soul. Yeah, it says life path, proceed. It says some steps can't be predicted. Allow life to show you the way. Go with the flow. Someone needs to go with the flow. Let go of control. Okay, some of you also need to practice being in solitude more. Okay, or you need to take more breaks. In your routines and your and your schedules okay 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 what else do they need to her and we gotta go tell me when to go okay we got let go <laughs> you guys are being called to let go it says release the desire to control this situation and leave it up to god's infinite wisdom to resolve everything beautifully tell me more tell me more tell me more Keep going. You're being asked to keep going. Okay. It says use the energy of any disappointments to fuel your creative project with authentic emotion. One more spirit. Thank you. We have helping children. It says part of your life purpose involves teaching, guiding, and helping younger people or young people in general. Okay. That's for some of you. What else do they need to her, spirit? What else do they need to her? What else do they need to hear, spirit? We have relax, meditate, or do something simple in order to set your subconscious mind free. Be conscious of how your inner wisdom arises. You need to learn how to read all kinds of information on your journey towards your dreams, not just your thoughts or the assumptions of your rational mind. Okay, tell me more. What else do I need to hear, Spirit, at this time? It says, now is the time to start doing what's good for you. Don't wait any longer. Time flies by faster than you think. Life is short, baby. Live your life. You are the creator of your own life. We got gratitude. It says, opens the door to all the good life has to offer. Be grateful often for what you have and you will receive more to be grateful for. Amen. Literally, this is the secret sauce. It says, life is at your service. You are worthy of everything you desire. Give life permission to create through you and become visible through your dreams. Okay? Listen, this is going to be the end of your reading. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. It definitely does help out the channel. If you're interested in booking a personal reading with me, please check my description box below where it says dot, dot, dot more. And you'll see my website, occultlifestyle.com. Um, click on that. You can book a reading with me or a Reiki session. If I am not available, you guys can go to mysticsense.com um, and you can book with another talented reader. Until next time. I love you guys. Thank you so much. Bye.